Welcome to Hold Your Power, guys. Power Radiance, I'm back. I'm back, Power Radiance. And I want to start out by asking you a question. Did you know that black women are being unalived at an alarming rate? And it's usually by those that they love? Well, Power Radiance, we have work to do. We have a lot of work to do, Power Radiance. Please share and like this video, Power Radiance. I believe it can prevent you, family, or friends from bringing toxic people in your lives or recognizing it is a toxic relationship before it goes too far. Now, I won't take up much of your time, but I believe this information I'm about to give will save lives. So, Power Radiance, let's get into it. Your dreams, your power, better hold it. Hold, your power. Hold your power, baby. Hold, hold your power. Mm -hmm. hold, hold your power. Hold your power. Welcome, Power Rainians. And for those of you who may be listening in for the first time, this channel is about inspiring people to live their best lives and to continue being a loving, caring person and to practice self love daily. And then spread it on out to others and always know that you hold the power in your life and no one can take it away from you. But you can give it away. And that is what this letter that you will be listening to in a minute from an abuser is all about. And one more thing, Paul Rainians, I have an assignment for you. I want you all to listen to the 10 statements he makes and give yourself five words for each statement that is true for you and zero if it does not apply to you. Once completed, we will talk about the scores. The title of this letter is For You, My Love. Also, do not forget to give yourself five points for each statement and zero if it does not apply to you. So let's get into it. Hi babe. Here are 10 of the reasons why I got away with treating you and other women in my life wrong. I hope you learned something from it. I am trying to change my ways. 1. It started off wrong the minute I met you. My plan worked. I knew you would pursue me. 2. My name is not Q, it's GR you never asked to see my ID. That was your fatal mistake. You should have checked me out through social media, or apps. 3. I like to lie a lot and you questioned none of my fishy stories. It's obvious you did not check me out otherwise I would have not deceived you for so long. 4. You pursued me by car, boat, plane, and train. 5. You freely gave me your money and took care of me. 6. You let me drive your car and move into your home, with you and your kids, after only knowing me for 6 months. I don't like kids, but you know that, but still say one day we will have a family. Do you know that becoming pregnant, increases the risk of you being on a lived by homicide at a 16% increase, more than a woman who is not pregnant? The biggest danger in pregnancy is homicide by people like me. 7. You let me back into your home after I cheated time and time again, wanting to believe my promise to be better was true. 8. I struck you many times and you lost a few teeth, I also put color to your eyes after you told me you would leave and never come back. Do you know leaving is the most dangerous time for a woman with someone like me in their lives? Never ever tell someone like me you will leave them. Move in silence with a plan and just do it. 9. I also sliced you a few times and torched your home. But you must admit I apologized and looked at you with the saddest face I could make and wiped my dry eyes. You with your kind-hearted ways and love for me fell for my acting skills and took me back. That was also a big mistake. I know my actions show I don't value or respect you. 10. But for the world of me, I cannot understand why you are surprised and hurt when I tried to unalive you. Statistics show, 
I will more than likely eventually unalive you due to our volatile relationship because you won't leave me. Signed GR. Now Power Rainians, don't forget to give yourself 5 points for each statement that applies to you and 0 if it doesn't. A score of 1 through 4 and you may be on the right track in your relationship. A score of 5 or more means you need to step back, assess the situation on how to get out, seek professional help, and lean on family and friends. Lean on someone, Power Rainians, that have your back and silently work on getting out of that situation and don't look back. Power Rainians, leaving is one of the most dangerous times for people who are in a toxic relationship. Get professional help from your local DV center and develop a strategic plan. File paperwork. A restraining order. Ghost the person. Take no chances, Pyrrhanians, with your life. Stay in charge of your life. Pyrrhanians, wherever you are in life, right now, tell yourself only love, peace, and harmony knock on your door. Say it until you feel it and mean it. Think about where you are in life right now. If it doesn't feel right, it just might not be right. For you, step back or walk away and reassess your life. Aside from the Almighty, you Pomeranians should always come first in your life. You are in charge of guarding your mind, body, and soul. You are in charge of opening the door to love and happiness, Pomeranians. You hold your power, and only you have the power to give it away. Take back your power. What signs are you ignoring in your relationship right now? Are you happy and content? What keeps you crying or sad, awake at night, or in fear for your life? Hold your power, Power Rainians. Take it back. Take it back. And choose you. Choose you, Power Rainians. Until next time, hold your power.